You want to ask you something? Beth, you hear it? Beth. I'm here. Can you hear me? Yeah. What's going on with you and uh, Brown Eyed Girl? Why are y'all fussing? Well, I was just talking about her makeup, right? That was Why? all I was. That, I, don't, I, haven't, I don't have a piece for, for her makeup. Um, like, not her makeup herself, her, her personally. I went after her eyebrows a few times. Other than that, I really don't have an issue with her. I but just, why? You know, pardon? But why? How does it feel when people come for your eyebrows, Beck? No, oh, well, that's the reason you why know. I started it, because they were all doing it to me. So I started going at everyone else's and their eyebrows at one point. Well, it doesn't make it right. I mean, come on. No, don't, yeah, I know. Leave it's people's it's looks I'm, alone. I'm, leave people's kids alone. Leave their parenting alone. Leave their addictions alone. Well, they, I don't get it. That's exactly what we've been trying to say to all these women. Why can't they leave our stuff that we have wrong with us alone as well? Because that's what they've been doing to us too. Well, you've been, they've been, well, doing you've been around long enough years. to know. There are trolls on the internet. That's what they're going to do. That That's what they do. But it doesn't make it right for us to go back and do the same crap to them, you know? Well, 90% of the time someone says anything to me, I'm going to retaliate. That's how I've always been. I'm trying not to. I know and that, but really that's not good for you because then it turns you get really manic and then you start to spiral and then you know how it goes. Well, We've seen the cycle. I've seen this. I've been in the cycle. How many times? A thousand. And you know what? I won't allow it to happen at this point in time. I'm doing pretty well. I'm doing my makeup and doing my videos now and actually enjoying myself again. You know what I mean? Like I before, I wasn't enjoying uh, myself. I saw you. You're back to work. I think you're working now and uh, yeah, I'm working. you're cleaning I'm up. You had a kitty room the other day. Just. Do your little vlogs the way you do, and your channel will grow organically. And people, I mean, Beck, you've caught a lot of shit. You know that. I, I know that. I've seen it. But well, that's just the way I've never ever said I haven't. No, that's the whole. That's the whole thing, though. I've been one hundred and fifty percent honest with every fuck up that I've made on here. I've always come back and said I fucked up, and I've tried to change the behaviour. Right, and I will say this much. Okay, sorry, I was looking at the computer. Um, I, I, Drinks. everyone, I, I'm sorry, but everyone's made a mistake on here. Um, yep. and really, and they've all been forgiven. Most people on this platform have been forgiven for their shitty ass behavior. And the people like myself or Sammy or anyone else that's in the non cool crowd, right? That's what I call it. It's, it's stupid. We, we, we still get raped over the goals over the fact that we are, um, what just because what we don't we don't go yes ma'am yes sir you know like we don't i don't beat to anyone's drum well, but my own look at me i'm, I just I'm rocking the wind and I ain't here, i've learned you know just sitting back watching the last couple of years with me not being on a channel when you sit back yeah. and watch and really see what goes on <laughs> you see the same behaviors but then there are people i've learned that they're either going to like you or they're not. So if yeah. they don't like you, keep it moving. Just keep it moving. Well, that's what I've, not what unless I've, you like, want, that's what you want out of your channel is fussing and fighting all the time. Then, you know, whatever, to each their own. But I don't they know, chase, I hate when, They chase and don't leave us alone. That's what you well, I can do my makeup videos, turn my comment sections on, on right? And, I'll, and you should see all the comments about how ugly I am. Like, I don't need that. And it hurts, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I don't want anybody to feel that way. Anybody. But it's okay for, say, I'll give you an example. Michelle, say that I'm nothing, I'm, I'm a bad freaking cat owner, which I'm not. Um, but anyway, a bad cat owner, a freaking terrible worker and all this sort of stuff. When she does no, not know me whatsoever as a worker that, anyway. You just said it. You it. just said it. That you just said it. Say that again. She doesn't know me. She doesn't know you. So what does it matter? The fact that for for parents, they're admit, the, Okay, so I understand. I, 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 I'm going to say it's okay. Let's just make. I understand one girl went out at me hard. All right, but what the hate that she has done. Is nothing compared to what I actually said 
to begin with. I don't. I don't know the history. You know what I mean? I don't. Well. But what I said, and I'll be quite honest with you, is I said, okay, if you know Mel, okay, Mel and Michelle, there's two peas in a pod, they freaking hang out with, with each other, right? Okay, so I said, because I was upset with Mel, okay, it was an over retaliation, and I've even said this publicly a thousand times, right, that I overreacted. But the fact is, is that I said that she sent no G, which... I thought it was a joke. Like I, I knew it was a joke, but no one else took it as a joke, right? And I understood that, and I apologized to her. To her, I was blue in the face, and I cannot keep apologizing because when you say it more than one time, it diminishes the meaning of it. You know what I mean? So that's all I've got to say. Like the whole boss and girl Bridget stuff, it's petty bullshit, and I know it's petty bullshit. That's why I don't. Care about it, and I just don't well, want to make well, up. Well, it may be you, you, but you know but how you, you know feel how when you feel when you come for your look. Come for your look. You know, you know, like you said in the like comment, said section, comment section, everyone has the same feeling for just on a keyboard. Well, that's why I, I. I, I was I did a video, an eleven minute video or whatever it was about Bridget a couple of weeks ago and about her makeup. I wasn't actually commenting on her personality because like I don't know her anymore. Like I haven't known her for a while because we don't talk privately anymore. But I was going on about I was talking about her makeup. I wasn't actually talking about her and her looks because her look I don't care what she looks like. Okay, at all. All right. Now, I'm wearing clown makeup right now. This is what my partner calls clown makeup, okay, because it's way too much. But this is the, this is a character I have on YouTube. It's called Fancy Nancy. I was doing a video um, with it before. Yeah, and I remember, it. I remember Fancy Nancy. Yeah, and well, Olivia, Fancy Nancy's Olivia, coming back. Olivia. Fancy Nancy's coming back because she's funny and she's, like, I've just got to know what jokes are appropriate and what are because that's where my brain doesn't connect sometimes is what's appropriate for what I say at home or in my private life to what I say on YouTube. You know what I mean? Because I've got like so much to say, but you know, like I can't say it when I'm Rebecca because they take it literally. Like I, I can say, oh, I freaking um like I'll I'll give you an example. I said I was on American Idol, I'm Australian Idol, right? Back in 2019 I said that, right? And I mm -hmm. joked about it. And I was not, I knew I was joking, but all of the women said I was lying. Even though, yeah, it was a lie, it was a joke because 